Hey guys, this is Getsumara, and welcome to what's going to be my next Let's Play. I wonder what it's going to be. Maybe it's Majora's Mask, maybe it's Paper Mario, maybe it's whatever's in the GameCube. That's right, welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine! Not... Yeah. If you see my page, I think we all know what I'm going to be playing now, so let me set down my Wiimote and pick up my GameCube controller. Which is a GameStop one, is a piece of crap. And you're going to hear me rant about it many, many times. If you've watched my streams, you've already probably heard it. So yeah. Here we are. All across Hyrule, a hero is born. And his name is Link. Welcome to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Oh yeah. I thought I'd just let you uh, sit here and enjoy the scenery for a while as we uh, get all adjusted into yet another Zelda Let's Play. What's it been? Um, <clears throat> the last time we've had one of these is since Oracle of Ages. It's been a couple Let's Plays and I'm really glad to get uh, back into the Zelda games because I've had a lot of fun with them. And this one is very much like my favorite ones, so we'll give this a good whirl. And here we are, there's uh, what I'd like to call my practice uh, file or playtest file as well. I've pretty much 100%ed it a couple times on the Wii version and if you've heard me rant about the mystery game, this is the mystery game. I own three copies of it and two of them do not work. Aren't I just the best fanboy ever for owning three copies of a single game? Yes, anyways, we'll start a new quest log. Doing it down here because I'm not afraid I'm going to overwrite my practice file or playtest. And we're going to call him... The Getsu. As you know, it has to be awesome. And we're pro Skittles, so let's go with that. <coughs> and we have to name our horse. There's many things I like to call him. I could call him GT, but then again, he'd be trying to mount me like a lion whenever we go. I can't call him Dario, so he'd be really on edge and going, What's going on? So he'd probably buck me off his back. I can't call him Blue either, because, you know, it'd be all that in a bag of potato chips, so it wouldn't like me riding him so much. And, of course, I can't call it Jess, because it wouldn't be able to speak to save its life. Although, then again, that might not become much of a problem. So this really breaks it down. We're going to call it Skittles. Or Skittles, we'll see what fits. Because it's pro Skittles. Come on, all of it fit? Yes, Skittles. Yes, because we're pro Skittles, and that's the name of our horse. I suppose I couldn't call it Creed either, because then it all of a sudden it had black hair going down its front. Oh, I better take my TV off 16 by now. Tell me. <clears throat> do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? They say it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. That is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favor I want to ask you, Getsu. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. When the world ends, dun dun dun. Not. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor, but would you go on my steed? Or stead, rather. You have never been to Hyrule, right? And those eyes just are filled with aspiration of loads of adventure and fun. As in the great kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle, and around it is a castle town community far bigger than our little village. It's like New Jersey with how much traffic there is. And far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world that God's created. You should look up upon it with all your own eyes. It is getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Sounds good. Let's go home. No blue eyes just fit him so well. Yes, they do. Oh, 
this music is so peaceful, I can't believe it. It's so relaxing, I love it. I think most of this music is. And there, I believe, is the pond. I guess we were gathering firewood. A big ass horse. And of course, we better lock the gate up because you never know what might sneak in. Oh, look at that beautiful spring. Don't you just want to bathe in there all day long? Then again, that'd be really relaxing. Now I want to take a bath in a nice and large bathtub, but all I have is my crappy shower down here. Good night, Russell. Yeah, his name is Russell. He'll figure that out right away. And there's his family, his mother, and his son, Colin. And Colin is awesome. And for once, Link has dirty blonde hair. Normally it's like blonde. I guess he's got tired of being original and got himself a hair dye, or dyed his hair. Who's this person? With a very slender figure. And why are they taking our horse? Hey! I get to you there! Oh, I just love his yell, it's so weird. Hey, you mind helping me herd the goats? They ain't listening to me lately. The all tarn, fun, and confusing. I just don't know what to do. I wear Skittles. You can't be pro Skittles without the Skittles, you know. And we get the control link. Of course, you use the analog stick to move around. A to roll. And that's all you really need to know. You can press up on the D-pad to check your items. Um, left, or rather right, to check your map. Again, not really intended. I'll show you a little map I made in quite a little moment. It's not really necessary right now, so let's talk to him. First, hey, get the squirrel. Come here, come here, come here, squirrel. Yeah, hey, hey, hey. Sorry, ADD kicking in. Well, not really. Link's just very hyperactive for his age. Come on now, hurry up and bring Skittles with ya. Well, uh, I suppose he went this way, so let's go check out Skittles. I love how he runs this game. He runs a lot faster than the other games. <coughs> Although, if you roll, you still are technically moving faster, but you know, who cares? And look how strong we are. Uh, uh, pick up the thing. Oh, yeah, strong man. Gonna walk there with the boulder. Yeah, this is how Link trains to be a hero. Then again, in a peaceful village, who needs a hero? We just want to be a strong man. Yeah! And apparently there's that slender figure with our horse. Aw, oh, our rock's gone. No more strong men to impress the slender figure, which is actually a lady. Aw. Such peaceful and sad music at the same time. Oh, hi, Getsu. I washed Skittles for you. Aw, oh, thank you. Some parts I kind of hope you didn't wash, but you know, it's better not to get into that. And now, let's talk to her. Skittles is a girl, too, so you have to treat her nice like one. Oh, but listen, Getsu, could you do something for me? Can you use a piece of grass to play the song for me? You know, the one that Skittles likes? Yeah, this is the equivalent of a Ponus song. So let's play it. I tried to play it for Skittles, but I just can't seem to play it the way you can, Getsu. Ah, I guess she can't blow as much as we thought she could. That's kind of a disappointment. I'm not trying to t I want to pick it up, I don't want to talk to you. Leave me alone. Go practice blowing more. And what the hell's with the triangle on her hand? Of course, the grass is in the shape of a horseshoe, and oh, it loves us. It's a happy horse. So let's mount it, and let's get out of here. Peace out, Ilya. So let's go back to the village and do our daily job, which consists of herding goats and being pretty much a day laborer in this town. So let's head to work.
Yeah, that's right. Welcome to Orden Village. A very, very peaceful and delicate looking town. And there's Russell practicing his uh, sword uh, techniques. And there's a Kuko. So, let's say hello to little Colin. Or that creepy guy staring at him looks like a pedophile. Oh wait, that's not Colin, that's a chick. Ah, if it isn't young Getsu, are you going to close down the ranch for the day? I just closed the shop myself. I'm sure you know about the mischievous monkeys that have been coming into the village lately. Those things worry me a bit. Better lock up tight here, I couldn't stand to have any more goods stolen. Can't trust that good-for-nothing husband to do anything right. Come on, Dad, you can't catch a silly little monkey. You're so embarrassing. Uh, well, no, I can't. I can't seem to do anything right. Uh, listen to us, Babylon. I didn't mean to keep you. It's mainly my worthless husband, so have fun at work. So that's what we shall do. And if you're playing the Wii version, all the maps now will be absolutely mirrored, so pretty much when you see my little maps, just literally mirror them, or just think of everything being the opposite side, practically. So now let's go up here. This is Orden Ranch. This is where the goats go here. And it's very important that the goats go here inside that little building. Because if the goats can't go here, where could they possibly go? In the village? Of course not. The goats want to go here. Sorry to get you in such a hurry, Gitsu. These guys have been awful skittish lately and they won't listen to a word I say. Sorry to ask, bud, but how about you and Skittles herd them into the bomb real quick, don't you know? We ain't got much time, so you think you can do it for me, Shulkamoop? Oh, sure. Let's do it. So, yes. He's telling us to start, and let's get the goats go here. There's ten of them. Come on, goats. In there. In there. Whoop. See how good I am at this. Probably not that good, but you know, you never know. Oh, wow. What? I'm missing a goat? Where? Oh, right here, you piece of crap. I was doing good. You will go here. The goats go here for a reason. Yeah, come back here. The goats don't go here. Where are they going to go? Because you're going here. Now go, you stupid goat. You're going here, and you're going to like it. Go here, and go here, and go here. Success. Goat in. Because the goats go in here. Get to Skittles. Much obliged to both y'all. I can cover everything tomorrow without having to relax you, or trouble you, so just sit back and relax, bud. Oh, but how about today I want to practice with the fences? Just wait a spell, bud, I'll get them the fences up, set up right tight, y'all yeah, shook them up. God, I can't speak to save my life. I'm such a patty. Oh, sorry that took so long. Okay, then ride all you want. Y'all get tired, alright? Just jump the gate and head back into the village, okay, bud? Alright, well, you can um, jump fences. And of course you want to hit A to dash, so you're running fast when you try to jump them, or if you're not going to jump them. And you'll run into them, and that'll be bad for both you and Epona. So, let's jump the fence and get out of here. Success. Aren't we just the best horse rider ever? We could make a lot of money on the tracks. But then Ilya would have our balls in a vice grip in no time. And do you want to save? Yes, I do. So we shall save right here. To save your progress during your game, press start and choose the save option in the bottom left corner of the collection screen. Well that's all good and well, but we're out of time, so next time on Let's Play Twilight Princess, we will go to sleep, because you know, Link's a lazy little bugger and has to sleep at the beginning of every single game. So I will see you then guys, goodbye.